The Case-Shiller Report and the FHFA Price Index recently came out, and they're both showing that home prices are starting to flatten out, which means the levels of appreciation will start to moderate. These are national reports, which don't always accurately reflect the statistics of our local market. But all in all, this is a good thing since we have had such a long stretch of tremendous appreciation. Exciting news for those buyers trying to get into the market that need a little help with their mortgage and would consider a multi-unit home. The Federal Housing Administration just announced this past month that they are expanding access to mortgage finances for homes that have or will have accessory dwelling units. Fannie Mae will accept as little as 5% down payments for owner-occupied two, three, and four unit homes. This marks the departure from the previous multifamily financing requirement of 15 to 25 percent down. The federal government understands that we have an affordability challenge, and this is one of the ways that they're trying to help. What does that look like in San Diego? Well, you can get up to a $977,500 mortgage loan with just 5 percent down, which could put you in reach of a multifamily home or a home with room for an accessory dwelling unit. Here's what the housing stats look like in San Diego County over the last 30 days. The median sales price of detached homes is down to $960,000. And for the first time in a long time, homes sold under the median asking price and by 12%. Days on market were up slightly to 15 and inventory improved as well. Condos and townhomes followed the trend of detached homes with the median sales price falling short of the asking but they maintained a median selling price of $650,000. Median days on market stayed short at just 13, and inventory is up, but obviously not enough to cover demand based on the short amount of time on market. Well, that's it for this month. Wishing you all a very happy Thanksgiving.